Some motherfuckers dwarm, son! Um, okay. Now, I know I've been on a, a on the, the superhero, um, fixture, so to speak. Uh, and it's kind of coincidental that some other YouTubers are, are, are actually talking about superheroes, too. But I wanted to ask, uh, what, what do you guys think is the best superhero movie ever made? Hands down, if, if anybody says, though, one of the Batman from the George Clooney or Val Kilmer era, um, kill yourself. Because, no. There's trolling, it's automatic trolling, and I already know, because I, I, a troll knows a troll when he sees one. So, no, it, 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 those two don't count. Do not count. I don't care what you say. I don't give a fuck what your reasons are. Jim Carrey, yeah, he's funny. Arnold Schwarzenegger, who's dumb as a box of rocks, so it, it was good, but doesn't count. Those two don't count. Any others, though? My personal favorite were, um, Hellboy, the Golden Army, uh, but the Dark Knight with Heath Ledger, obviously, you could, uh, I got a picture of the Joker right there, but that's, that's regardless of what I'm saying, I think that one was hands down the most dope superhero movie that came out, especially because he killed Batman's bitch, he was, he was awesome, he inspired a lot of people into, um, you know, anarchy, so to speak, and, and getting people out of the mindset of, of money, you know what I mean, it just, he was such a good villain that he made people actually think about, like, Whoa, this, you know, it was, it was awesome. It was just so good, and and he was nuts. He was fucking crazy. And I think it, it overshadowed any of the, the Batman movies. I mean, he, he, Bane was a badass in The Dark Knight, but the Joker completely outshadowed Bane 100%. Like, Bane had to whoop, you know, the shit out of an old-ass Batman, whereas the Joker had Batman run around, didn't know what the fuck to do. And uh, it was just, oh, he was, he was the, it was the best superhero movie I've ever seen. Hands down. It was Dark Knight. Dark Knight numero uno, son. But, I mean, a lot of shit coming out now is going to be dope. And, and we, we got Avengers 2 and then the Avengers 3, which I'm more excited about the Avengers 3 than the Avengers 2 because Ultron's in the Avengers 2, but Thanos is in the Avengers 3. And it's just, it's going to be insane. People are going to be dying. Superheroes. And my favorite, my favorite part about superhero movies are the villains themselves because the villains make the movies. Let's be honest. Superheroes, you know what to expect from them, but the villains are the ones who fuck everything up, and they just, they, they, they turn and change the superheroes, so it's dope. So, uh, yeah, just let me know what your favorite fucking superhero movie was, bar none, hands down, but you, if you say something stupid, okay, I'll let you choose that Batman movie with either George Clooney and the Bat Nipples or, or Val Kilmer, but you have to have a reason why. You have to have a reason why. Because I know you motherfuckers are going to be saying that shit. And, um, you know, just, just letting it all out. Or, you know, you gotta, if you liked it for a certain reason. For instance, Spider-Man 3 fucking sucked. But Venom was in it. So the simple reason that Venom was in it made it a good movie. I like Venom from the get-go. They're saying. But, yeah, just let me know down there, motherfuckers. And, um, yeah, Dark Knight was the best Batman movie ever anyway. I mean, let's be honest. Batman Begins kind of sucked, although Raz Al Ghul was cool. Uh, the Dark Knight Rises was awesome, because Bane was a badass motherfucker, and it inspired people to hit the gym. And, um, you know, he talked like, oh, he talked like Deckard Kane from Diablo 2. And, you know, but let's be honest, Dark Knight, Joker, can't beat that shit. Peace out, motherfuckers.